What's going on folks, Rick here, back with another video, and I'm here to uh, do a quick unboxing of the Spigen uh, Ultra Hybrid case for the Galaxy Note 5. I did one of these for the LG V10, uh, and I got a lot of people asking questions about it, so I figure I'll do one for the uh, Galaxy Note 5. So real quick, just to look at some of the box, uh, some of the branding here on the box, you have some Spigen branding over here, um, it does highlight the air cushion technology. Uh, Spigen offers a lot of different cases, but one of the reasons why I continue to go with the Ultra Hybrid um, case is because it has this air cushion technology, and I'll show you guys what that entails uh, as soon as I unbox it. Um, I will admit I did unbox this already because I've been using it on my phone. I haven't had a chance to do a video, uh, so I'll be going through the motions here. So real quick. It has a little pull tab here. We'll open it up. So realistically, when you open up the case, what's going to be inside of it is the, uh, it'll be in a plastic, uh, little plastic bag, and you'll have the certificate of authenticity. Okay, so you do have um, this clear plastic on here that you could peel off to uh, prevent fingerprints and all that. And let's take a look at the case before we really uh, put it on the phone. Uh, if you look right here, let me try to zoom in. Okay, uh, this is what I was referring to, the air cushion technology, if you see it right there. On all four sides, you have these little air cushions right here, and that's to help you out when uh, you're dropping the phone. It has these cushions on the side, and it's supposed to, uh, you know, cushion the, the phone uh, better than just a standard uh, TPU case. So it does have, uh, like, a glossy, shiny uh, plastic TPO on the back. The sides seem to be a little bit more of a soft touch. Over here you have your uh, power button with the uh, PWR wording over here and you have your volume up and down buttons right here off to the side. Uh, zoom in a little bit. Up top you have your microphone uh, port right over there. Uh, on the Note 5 you no longer have an IR blaster so there's only that one cutout over there. On the bottom, you have your cutout for your microphone, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, your micro USB, and your speaker grill, in addition to the um, S Pen cutout. And yes, the S Pen cutout is big enough uh, for you to be able to easily take the S Pen in and out, and I'll demonstrate that as soon as I put the case on. So without further ado, let's put the phone in the case. Okay, so this is what it looks like with the case on. Like, as you can see here, I'm going to try to wipe it down. It does collect a lot of fingerprints. Most of the fingerprints are actually on the phone itself and not on the case. So don't get discouraged when you see that. The Note 5 is a fingerprint magnet. So uh, with having a clear case, basically if there's a lot of fingerprints on the phone, it's going to show through on the case. Um, so yeah, so this is what it looks like. Here's all the cutouts right here. Here is your S Pen cutout. There you go. Goes in and out very easily, no issues. That's basically what the case looks like on the phone. Uh, you know, not too much, you know, in design here. It's just more of a clear case if if you really like that minimal look and you want to show off the look of your phone. Um, you know, I really like the, the gold version that I just purchased. I'll be doing a, a video on that as well. Um, so that's the uh, quick unboxing of the Spigen Ultra Hybrid case. Uh, please give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Any comments that you have, leave it in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys in the next one.